Alright everyone, so this is the fourth and final video, so for my haul. Um, I want to get this done because it is 20 after 2 in the morning and I am tired, so I think I should just get this done, but I wanted to finish it so you guys could have the whole haul and I'm not going to be here for a couple days to actually, um, to actually upload any more videos after this really so um the next is swatches of um my nyx products my nyx um shadows uh the jumbo pencil shadows so um the f next is this one and um so this is uh cottage cheese and it is 608 and the the swatch of it which there you go is right here okay let's see if I can do this better for you the swatch of it is the first one right there and I will tell you I'll give you guys an update and tell you what happened to my hand right there I'll tell you that story if I have a chance tomorrow so, right, just point at this, okay? It'll be easier. Right there is cottage cheese, the very first one. Okay, so the second is lavender in, and it's number 214. That's what it looks like, the pencil. It's just very light, and that's right. Oh, I guess I need to do it this way. This is awkward. I saw someone do it in their video. Um, right there, the second one. Okay, moving on. My next one is yogurt, which is 611. And it is yogurt, like I said. And that's what it looks like. And so that's sort of the first kind of bronze color. Oops, just drew on myself. That was smart. Right there. Next, we have number 617, which is iced mocha. Apologize. I wish I had like a better quality, but um, there you go. And that is that one right there. So I will give you a close up of these. So the first one was um, cottage cheese. Uh, what did I say? Lavender. And then this one is yogurt. I am left-handed and I just wrote a bunch of stuff so <laughs> that's why that's there. All right this one is 620 and it is called bronze. I really hope I'm not being loud because my roommate has to be up at early. Well, she's probably, she'll leave the house probably by like 8 or 8.30 for school. And yeah. So there's the bronze color. And that will be right there. The second to last one on the end. So right there. It's actually pretty shimmery. It really is like a it's very metallic actually and I don't know why you can't see that really. Does that help any better? They're all very metallic really. So, well most of them. Anyways, moving on. Um, this is 615 and it's slate. It looks like a black. And it, unless you're like right there in person, it really does kind of look like a black. Um, so that's it there on the end. It 
even in person it looks pretty close to black so it probably like a char <laughs> slate is probably a fairly appropriate name for it um I'm just putting it under the really bright light here to see if it it looks it's pretty close to black pretty pretty darn close so this one is six I'm excited to show you this so this is um 618 and it is called purple this is the swatch of it it looks pretty electric blue like it looks blue um when I bought it it um when I bought it at the NYX counter, uh, they, not NYX counter, but the NYX uh, booth, they, it really looked very purple. And ever since it has looked blue and it's been really bothering me. But the swatch for it, let me show you this, is right there. This is the very first one on the top. That's right. That's it. Look. And I'll show you. The purple makes me so excited. I love this color so much. I just like, I think that's so cool. Um, yeah, because when I got it home, I was actually kind of bummed. I was like, are you serious? Like, why, what, why isn't it purple? Like, it was when I bought it. Um, I guess just the lights were so bright. So, um, so these are all just the Jumbo Eye pencils, by the way. The next Jumbo Eye pencil. Not that you can focus that. There you go. And this one is 605 Strawberry Milk. It's actually really pretty. Um, it's actually pretty, uh, it's a very, um, uh, pastel color and it you can't tell very well okay if I could get a hold of my which way to turn there we go so it's the one right next to the bright purple on that side there we go right there right oh right there <laughs> so um yes I'm not very good at this whole backward stuff as we know from other videos but nonetheless this is number 607 and it is horseradish. I'd like that to focus so you can see the spelling. R A D D I S H. Now the only one this is the only one with a fault to it is the back came off when I was undoing it. So I'm just you can feel the glue on it too, so I'm just gonna use some nail glue to stick it back on. And I don't remember how much these pencils were at IMATS. I'm sure I could look it up. I don't remember what they were. Um, so it is this color right, the first and only green one. Right there. Um, and I swatched them this way so that you could see them because I saw another YouTube video where the lady did it like this and um, funny enough this is green and it's horseradish and the, she had one that was um, called lemon and it was a green and we, she's like well, I feel like it should be called lime well there's also a green that's called lime so it's kind of funny um, yeah it's pretty random they, some of their names don't even make sense the eyeshadows, when I was showing you the eyeshadows, one of them was called Pacific. This one is called Pacific. And I only noticed that when I was doing the, when I showed it to you. I was like, well, actually, I have one of the Jumbo pencils. So this is 616 Pacific. And that's what it looks like. So the Pacific is right here, right, and that's green, that's horseradish, so it's kind of a, it's a soft blue, right, 
nowhere near where I'm pointing. There we go, right next to the green. I'm sorry, you guys. Right next to the green, right there. So it's, a, yeah, it's definitely a soft, unless you go over it like a bunch of times, then it kind of becomes like a pastel. That's the big one, the next to the green. Um, I still really like it, and it's Pacific, so um, near the Pacific Ocean. So, yeah. And this one here, this last pencil, is um, 622A, which is the only one I've seen with um, a letter. And it's called Electric Blue. That's what it looks like. Pretty darn cool. So, um, it is this one right here. Right there. So right next to the pink. It's a really cool color. It'll just refresh it a bit for you. And it's pretty, it's really metallic for you. So again, it's right the second one in. Yeah, I really like this. Oh, I'm very excited to try all these. I need to get an eye primer. Um, I'd like to go and get the Urban Decay primer so that I can do these because if I just put this over my lid or something right now, it can crease. Um, and I really want the Urban Decay primer anyway, so this is a kind of an excuse to get it. But um, yeah, but so once I get the primer, I can be using it as eyeshadows. Until then, I think I would just use a bit for liner. And the swatch, the final swatch that I have is not an eye, not a pencil, not an eye thing at all. Is actually the NYX, so, NYX, the NYX Soft um, Matte Lip Cream. And it says that, the bottle says, it's not a lipstick nor is it a gloss. It's like nothing you've experienced before. It's lipstick cream that goes on silky but looks soft matte. So it was really cool. I didn't even read that before but I was trying some of the glosses and I really didn't want anything sticky and I was finding that and I just didn't want it. So the swatch of it is right is the very end one here. That's it there and this stuff is very um very opaque you have there's so much color to this that you let's do it right here look if i just take the little thing and then go like that look how dark that is so when you put it on your lips when i tested it i um i actually smushed it around a bit and a lot went a long way like you can see how much that is right there like and that's still needing some work to it so it's very nice um and in case I didn't I didn't really show you the brush um it's just a standard sort of lip gloss type brush so this I am going to use um probably for myself but for now I'm just going to use it in a sanitary way and not use the brush. I'm just going to put some in on a palette and use the lip brush because in case I decide that I'd rather have it in my kit. So that's that. And then the very, very, very last thing I got from iMats, other than the presents I told you that you will see over um, in a while, uh, are is a NYX. I got the NYX sharpener says NYX and the reason I got it is because and I recently bought a pencil sharpener but A it's good to have a few when you're a makeup artist but B this one I know for sure fits their jumbo pencils so um I didn't want to have to have one and then be like oh darn like I can't sharpen it um so and I actually really like it because the the bottom piece, the bottom plastic, comes off so you can empty it and clean it, um, which is kind of cool. But also the top comes, that wasn't even in the frame, the top also.